Mark Jarella, probably one of the best guys I've ever seen, three-time NCAA champ from Michigan. And I know I throw a lot of names out there for you guys, but I'm telling you, man, when you find the best guy that did it the best at the top of the top of the heap in the, in the sport, then dude, study that guy. So my guy won three NCAA titles. A lot of people call this movie Chirella because he was so doggone good at it. Mark is the dad, uh, Josh, and I can't remember the other kid's name. Um, both didn't, I don't think they started wrestling until like middle school. I think they both were multiple time All-Americans, all right? But the dad was like synonymous with this. But some people call it a ball and chain, pump handle tilt, all right? I call it a Chirella, all right? So double side pride, all right? I'm swinging, same thing we've been doing. Now I'm snaking down to the wrist and I'm driving him down flat to the mat and he feels me kind of start to pull this. So he's gonna hip down and hide his hand. My free hand just reaches under and grabs his wrist. Now, this is where we change with our tilt. I don't like curling and going straight back, okay? I like turning my elbow up towards his shoulder, right here, shoulder blade, all right? Scapula, all right? I'm driving 45 degrees, because he might be posting right here, but he ain't gonna be posting real long when he feels that, yep, okay? See, I'm lifting, and I'm driving 45. Okay, when I get here, see how I got my leg over the top of his? I just pinch my knees, okay? I just pinch my knees and hold right here, all right? And then watch this, when he bellies back down, when I'm ready for him to, oh, leg comes right back in. Or I could just keep this and come right back on top, cross my ankles, and then go to my bar, all right? And then start going to work from here and pinning, all right? But it's when I hook this arm and he fights that hip and his hand down because he don't want me to pull him up, okay? I just reach under and grab his wrist. Fight, everybody calls this ball and chain, right? Okay, I'm just ball and chain with a back hook, but I don't fall straight back. I point my elbow and I try to find that little pocket right up under his shoulder blade and I drive that direction, okay? And then when I get here, I don't like taking this leg out. I just leave it in and I pinch everything tight here, okay? And if he turns into me, I just kind of push him away. And then if he goes away, I just kind of pull him in. Okay? And I'm pinching right here. He comes back up on top. Maybe he comes back up on top and I keep it and then change to a half right here. Drop to my elbow, <coughs> put him on his back. And you can just start playing in that position and figure out what you want your sequence to be, okay? Where you go. So we're just 